The back floating is one of the most important skills because you have to be able to float if there's nothing to hold on to. If you're in a lake or a pond and you're a very young baby and you're not strong enough to get back to the side and hold on, you've got to be able to float on your back. And even if it's just momentarily and you're bobbing up and down, then you're going to buy yourself time. As you practice more and more, baby will begin to relax and their confidence in the water will grow. You can then remove one hand from their head and eventually both. This exercise begins to give babies a sense of their own buoyancy. It also gets them used to knowing when to breathe when they are bobbing up and down in the water. However, not all babies manage to back float on their own at first. It can be a very long process. If baby finds it hard, don't worry. Just keep practicing or if your baby gets distressed, it's best to stop and come back to this exercise in a few weeks time.